Right. <laughs> Streak of one. Let's go defect. From the, the easiest to the hardest right now. Right, let's go. Slime again. Back to back slime. Kind of rough. Oh god, enemies you next to me comments have 1 HP. Okay, clearly our last defect run didn't go too well. <laughs> whenever, you, whenever you see this, it's like, oh yeah, okay, last time was... Uh, last time must have been rough. Man, I love that you know, the weather's actually getting quite nice here in England now, man. We've got blue skies, sun's out. It's lovely. It's, it's t-shirt weather almost. Right. On Saturday, actually. Um... I had people around for drinks in the evening, but I, I was just on my own in the garden, having a beer, watching the football on the iPad, about 2 p.m. on my own. It was lovely. It was lovely. Right, let's go. So, can we get to an elite um, on one HP? Potentially, we could do enemy, event, shop, enemy, event, elite. We could do that. Yeah, dude, we got snow here at the start of April. Shit was wild. Uh, okay, let's go. I mean, we should try and do it, right? We should definitely try and do it. Okay. Play smart. Give me some good cards. Fire potion. It's always good to get a potion in the first combat. Go for the eyes, barrage, beam cell. Now, these are the types of cards with defect where normally I just overlook them. Did you smash at the party? Um, well, it was just my male friends and their partners. Um, so no. <laughs> I didn't smash in the fight. <laughs> um. I would normally overlook all of these cards. So, yes. <laughs> um. Like, I actually, this is the kind of situation where I struggle a lot. Like, bar I've had games where Barrage has been good. I've been to some games where go we're going for the eyes of Beam Cell have been good, but normally they tend to be like claw runs, which we could do. Like, I shouldn't rule out claw, but if we upgraded one of these, I mean, the thing with, the thing with Defect is that upgrading the starting cards are quite good. Like, with Silent, like, upgrading Neutralize is good, but upgrading Survivor is not that good. With Watcher, like, upgrading Eruption is good, but upgrading Vigilance isn't that good. With Ironclad, upgrading Bash is not that great. Whereas Zap and Jewelcast are both very good upgrades. So it, it makes it kind of harder to upgrade other cards. So, like, if I'm thinking about Beam Cell, only for it's upgraded, Sense is, like, on upgrade Zap and Jewelcast and Beam Cell, you know what I mean? But I think we do have to add a card. Like, I think this is where I go wrong with Defect. I turn down too many cards early on. Like, so I think I do have to take a card here. If that story ended with so yes, it would have been a better story. <laughs> Did you smash an alcoholic beverage? Many, many an alcoholic beverage was smashed. Let's go beam cell. Let's try it. Let's try it out. 75 gold, lose 11 HP. Shot. Honestly, Orori is pretty good early on. Akabeko is just guaranteed extra damage. But Orori, having five cards to choose from, thicken out our deck a little bit, is pretty good. So I think I'm going to take it. Right, let's get some good cards. And I guess we can look at all the cards and then decide what we want to add. Streamline, Doom and Gloom, Bullseye. Streamline and Doom and Gloom are both pretty good early game. I mean, the Dark Orb isn't that good early game, but the AoE damage is good. Streamline's pretty good for elites and damage in general. Hyper Beam? Oh, God. <laughs> Hyper Beam, Cold Snap, Glacier. I mean, Glacier is, like, really strong. But Hyper Beam is a totally different kind of deck. That I guess does work quite well with Beam Cell. Beam Cell again, Defragment or Storm. Wow, we've got some big decisions to make here. White Noise, Rebound, Charge Battery. Like, honestly, we probably want to add, like, four or five cards here. 
Like, we're probably adding a lot of cards. When, when, our, when our deck is just strikes and defense, we want to be adding stuff. So I'm not going to be skipping many of these at all, if any. Hologram stack chill. Right. So I think already... We've got to... Decide what direction we want to take. Like, do we want to build around orbs or not? Because let's see, if we go, if we go Hyper Beam, like Hyper Beam is like the craziest card here. If we go Hyper Beam, what would we take of these? We'd probably take Streamline. So it'd probably be Streamline and Hyper Beam. And then we'd take, well, we wouldn't want Defrag or Storm. So it'd be Beam Cell or nothing. I've already got one Beam Cell, I don't think I'd need another one. So that would maybe be a skip. White Noise, Rebound, Charge Battery. We'd either go Rebound or Charge Battery. And then we'd go Hologram. One Hyper Beam doesn't make you forget Orbs. Uh, if we went Orb stuff, we would probably go Bullseye or Doom and Gloom. And then we'd go Glacier. And then we'd go Defrag. And then we'd either go White Noise or Charge Battery. And then we get chill. And so we'd have a lot of frost. We'd have chill and glacier, so it's good frost orbs. Shit. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do one of those two things. Bearing in mind we're on a, we won our last run, so this would be two in a row. So we we're gonna We're gonna try hard here. Basically the key bucket is this one, right? This is the key bucket. Hyper beam or glacier. Stream and not looking at my meme. I'll look at your meme. It might make the stream crash though. That's a problem. Uh oh no, we're okay. We're not crash. We are not crashing. We are live. We're live and alive. Jackie at the party. <laughs> they don't know I got up to three wins in a row and slay the spire. <laughs> Jackie's male friends. <laughs> Um, actually, one of my mates at the party d d does play Slow This Buyer. Only one of them. So, yeah. <laughs> we also played some chess. I brought some chess boards. We played some chess. I'm bringing, I'm bringing, like, I'm bring, trying to, like, bring the nerd into my group of friends a bit. It's, it's going okay. I'm penetrating the group a little bit, getting the nerd in there. So, uh, yeah, everyone's playing chess. Um, Slay This Buyer, there's only one of them, though, so... Yeah, long way to go on that one. <laughs> right, Hyper Beam or Glacier? Um, right, we are going to go... Honestly, I don't think Hyper Beam is a good way to be in the heart. Like, orbs are... Like, if I'm thinking about it, like, Hyper Beam is much better early game. But the orb stuff is way better late game. And Glacier is one of the best cards. So I'm going to add Glacier. I'm going to add Defrag. I'm going to think about that one. We're going to add Chill. Okay, so we've got Glacier, Defrag, Chill. Um, Bullseye or Doom and Gloom? Probably Doom and Gloom. And then White Noise, Rebound or Charge Battery. I got my 10 year old nephew in the Slater Spire. Hey, nice. Is he smashing it? My brother's my brother's been playing it lately, and uh, I'm trying to get my dad into it, but I, but I haven't got my dad into it just yet. Oh shit! I forgot, I'm going for a meal with my dad tonight. Actually, I forgot about that. Um, white noise rebound charge battery. White noise is mediocre. Sometimes very disappointing. A good charge battery. It's always charge battery is always okay. Okay, they're all still on one health here. Sunder, Sweeping Beam, or Heat Sinks. Whenever you play a power card, draw a card. I've currently got one power card. Sunder is okay. This could definitely turn into a uh, Sneko deck, by the way. Doom and Gloom, Glacier. Probably do. We don't have that much damage at the moment, which I think means we do take Sunder. And hopefully we don't get an enemy here, and then we get one health elite. Okay. 
Transform a strike into something good. Consume. That's orb stuff, but it's not a card we can play very much. Man, we've added so many cards. Added so many cards here. Toxic Egg is insane! Whenever you add a skill into your deck, upgrade it. Yo, this is going to be a massive deck. This is going to be a huge deck. We've already added loads of things. Cool Headed Plus, Multicast Plus, Streamline. I'm not a massive fan of Multicast Plus. I think I'm going to go Cool Headed Plus here. Cool Headed Plus. Right, what do we upgrade? It's either Sunder. Wait, what does upgraded Doom and Gloom do? 14 damage to all enemies. Thunder or Defrag? Defrag is good. Zap's good. I think we have great Thunder for now. I need my damage. And I think we're going to go for the Elite, definitely. Right, let's go. Doom and Gloom is pretty good here. Mm, we could maybe get away with saving the Firepot here. It's maybe a little risky, but I think we can get away with saving it, which means we can do quite well on another Elite fight. I'm going to kill them both evenly here, because the Dark Orb's going to wreck one of them anyway. To be fair, I guess it could have let me proc the dark hole here, but couldn't know if that would happen or not. Anchor, start each combat with 10 block. Melter turbo plus cool headed plus. Yo, is this a blizzard deck? Yo, this is actually a blizzard deck. We've got Glacier, two cool headed plus, and a chill. Um. Try and go to this elite up here. Then again, we could visit another campfire if we go this way. There's still loads of cards I want to upgrade. So going to a campfire would be good. This is the way where we can do an elite and a campfire. It means we have to go through a shop. And it's, we haven't got that much gold for it, but we'd probably do it. Every three times you shuffle your draw pile into energy. Okay. Knob. Knob's a bit tricky. This is a horrendous hand. My big damage cards for this fight are Doom and Gloom and Sunder. I feel like I have to, might have to consume here. Otherwise, I don't think we're gonna have the damage. 
So we can defract Glacier, we can Sunder, we can defract Doom and Gloom. Sunder. It's lethal. That was sketchy. It was sketchy, but we got it. Okay, happy flower. Every three turns gain one energy. So both of these are to do with, do with getting energy. So more energy means more expensive cards and more card draws. Good. Oh my god, Electrodynamics. I mean, Ball Lightning solid, but Electrodynamics is the nuts. The nuts Act 2 card. We're not at Act 2 yet, but it's a great card. Oh, pellets, but we can't afford it. We can't afford the pellets. Fusion Plus. Things. I'm gonna remove strike. Bird. Jackie's love for Electrodynamics is as problematic as his love for Sozu. How? What do you mean? Electrodynamics is literally the best defect card. Turbo Plus. Probably get Ball Lightning. Upgrade. It's a card we're going to play every single fight, without fail. Wow, that's a big chill value. Huge. Huge! Nice. Fruit juice. Defragment or Leap Plus? Probably Defragment, but we're going to want to upgrade it. Right, upgrade defrag. So we want to upgrade two of our D defrags. We want to upgrade both of them. If we're just trying to pop it as low as possible, we skip the frag here. So I think we do that. Electro is humongous. Wow. Destroyed the slime. Absolutely destroyed the slime. All right, let's keep this rolling. Fission plus Meteor Strike Thunder Strike. Fission plus is very strong. <laughs> I think it's gotta be Fission plus. Empty Cage calling Bell Sozu. I think we know what the pick is here. <laughs> I think we all know what the pick is here. <laughs> Electro gives amazing front loaded AoE damage, which is exactly what Frost and Dark is bad at. As is tradition, I think it's Bell Psy. Wait, don't tell me you guys would actually take Empty Cage or Calling Bell over Sozu here. Come on, man. 
We've got multiple two energy cards. We've got a three energy card. And you'd, you go for the non-energy relic. Always take Bell. It's easy, Sozu. Easy, Sozu. Sozu's nuts. All right. Um, so I feel like we're pretty strong. Are we strong enough to go for maximum elites? And like, we're gonna be a bit careful here because elites at Act Two are definitely what could get us killed. But if we're strong enough, we want to do it. We don't have a ton of damage. But yeah, I think we want to go for elites. It's not really a good path at the start here. I want, I want some more events, really. Like, I don't really want the normal fights. Mm. The way to do two elites here, and then a third one, is like... Enemy elite, enemy elite. Which is quite a lot of fights back to back. That would be enemy, enemy, enemy. Event, enemy, elite, enemy, elite. That's a lot of fights. It's a lot of fights. Like, it would be nicer to do, like, enemy, event, enemy, enemy, event, campfire, elite, event. And then go towards the flaming elite. That would mean we're only doing two elites. But it's just a nicer path. We go through two campfires. We go through more events. We don't have to do the flaming elite as well when we get there. Yeah, I'm going to go up this bright path. So bad. <laughs> Alright, let's just place here then, play it safe. Aggregate plus leap plus. Kind of hard to turn down leap plus. Like anything that says plus is just pretty good. Aggregate plus is okay if we've got more draw. We do have fission plus and double cool headed plus. Which does make aggregate tempting. But I feel like we need to remove more stuff first. I'm gonna go aggregate. Let's go for it. It does kind of make sense. Bag of marbles or a chalcom chemex. Or just remove a card. Yo, yo, how's the street going? Hey, Jolly, how we doing? Oh, Nightbot lies! It's actually not zero, yeah. We're actually on one. Nightbot is lying. Um, let's remove a strike. Huh. 
Second aggregate? I mean, I would... I, I don't want to play 77 gold for it, really. Okay, so now I can play the whole hand, which is nice. Smash the birds. Reinforce body plus. It's really good. I love reinforce body. Really, really strong card. Aggregate again up to 10 energy. Holy shit. We need more draw. We need some skims. Some more cool headeds. Electro here should be lethal. Nice. Boot sequence plus block on turn one. Normally, I really like boot sequence. But I feel like we've got quite a lot of block in the day. Right, we need a bit more draw and damage. You have anchor too. Yeah, we have anchor too. Yeah. Like, normally I would snap pick this, but this is the kind of deck where I don't feel like we need it. So I'm gonna skip. Upgrade a card, obtain a special relic from Curse. Okay, we'll upgrade. You're the defrag. So we've got two upgraded defrags. So that's already four focus in the deck. Pretty solid. Here we'll upgrade. We can upgrade consumables that. Upgrade consume. Maybe this is a turn where we would have liked the um, boot sequence. But it's probably fine. Yeah, didn't even need the pot really. Whenever you're in a rest site, so let's come up with two energy. I don't need any of these. Uh, recycle, though. I mean, we can use Recycle to get rid of the strikes and defense. That is a thing. But it's quite slow. It's quite slow. We can Recycle Sunder. Like, I feel like if we had more draw, Recycle would be good. But draw is still more way more important. It's, it's cool, though. I'm gonna skip. Oh, 
no, I hate this fight. God, reinforced body is so nuts. Glacier, nice and safe. The glacier is super nice. <coughs> Alright, should I get lethal here? Yeah? Lovely. Cold snap, loot plus, recycle plus. You're infinite with recycle sundial. Cycle Sundial. It just doesn't really do anything the time we play it. It's not good on the first few turns. It could be good in the longer fights. Cycle of Strike, Cycle of Four Defense. Cycle down to two cool headed pluses and then play them over and over and then one blizzard or something. Um, we need more draw to harness the power of cycle. Yeah, I feel the same. I feel the same. I'm gonna skip. More bank whenever you climb a four, gain 12 gold. Um, I mean, I'm gonna go with this flaming elite, so we'll skip the shop now. This does get me a bit of gold. But I could take the key here. It's a bit of a late more bang, but I'm still gonna take it. Where's that? Obtain a relic, become cursed. No. Elite. Man, the Electro is so big. The Electro is like so, so big. Aggregate doesn't do much here. Could doom and gloom or could just reinforce body. Let's just get rid of this debuff guy. Take some damage, but whatever.
Uh, raise your max HP by 7. Green key. Melter, Compile Driver, Claw. Compile Driver's card draw. It does feel like we need more card draw, so I think we take it. And then, spin the wheel. Okay, don't screw me, wheel man. Don't screw me. What do we want? We want a relic or remove a card are the best two. Gold is okay. I feel like gold is the one I get the most often. Sure. Wait, did we just get 200 gold? I'm sure we normally only get 100 gold for that. Is it random how much gold you get? I'm sure I normally get 100. Not sure how that works. You get oh a hundred per act. Oh, okay, that's cool. I missed. Yeah, I, I don't understand that. I'm sorry. D English, please. I'm assuming you're saying 100 in Act 1, 200 in Act 2, 300 in Act 3. Fight is pretty sketchy here. Um, this is a sketchy turn. I don't like this turn at all. Sweeping beam, ball lightning, beam cell. I do like ball lightning. I think we can do another one. Right, gonna have to rest here for sure. Gotta rest up here. Okay, only 43 health against these guys. It's not a whole load. I hope I get to play Electro before they steal it. Nothing to block. Man, this is kind of sketchy. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. White vision like that to try and draw my powers. either play it and try draw stuff or don't play it and do nothing. This is going to be very scary, man. I think I'm going to struggle to kill this guy. I gotta have loads of block next turn. No! We've drawn reinforced body at the wrong time. I think we die next turn. 
We've got Glacier and Cool Headed. Three energy. Can we survive this? Yes, we can. Nice. Big survive! Huge survive! Okay, that was a little bit sketchy. A little bit sketchy, but we got through. We got a lot of gold. 579 gold here. Reboot plus Thunderstrike, Vision plus. Vision plus again. I, st I still feel like we need one or two more orb cards. Especially the, the block stuff. Like another Glacier, another Cool Headed, that kind of thing. We'll go Vision plus again. Sacred Bark, Pandora's Box, Velvet Choker. Oh, God. So, if we went Pandora's Box, it only transforms five cards. We can't go Sacred Bark. So, it's either Box or Choker. Choker's not very good in this deck. These are really awful options. These are terrible options. These are actually terrible options. I think it has to be box, but it's a really bad box in general. Alright, box it is. Auto shields plus, amplify plus, overclock plus, storm or form. Overclock's okay. Amplify can be good. Storm all for one, aren't that great? It's 100% skip. Now, we definitely box over skip. We definitely box over skip, but it's not very good. It's not very good at all. Right, we maybe go straight to this shop. All for one does work with Zap and Jewel Cast. Yeah, it works with Zap. Chill doesn't make matter with. Vision doesn't matter with. Works with Overclock. I quite like doing the events here. And then doing this Elite and going through this shop. Maybe that's a bit greedy. There's not really many good paths here. I don't want to go to the right hand side. We need to get to a shop soon ish. So it's either this one at the start or one of these two. Okay, I think we're going to go through this shop at the start. Strong turn one. Very strong turn one. Equilibrium plus, Chaos plus, Tempest plus. Well, we didn't get an energy relic. But Tempest plus is still a little bit tempting. I don't love Tempest. I don't think Tempest is a great card. It's 
It's only good if we get a ridiculous amount of energy. Which sometimes in this state we do. Sometimes we do. With the visions. <laughs> Let's take Tempest. It does exhaust itself. Oh shit, ice cream. Energy is now conserved between turns. I think we take that. Does that make charge battery better? Next turn, gain one energy. What would we remove? Um, man, it's so much harder to decide what to remove after, after you've after you've had a box. <sighs> Honestly, the deck isn't that bad. It would probably be beam cell, or all for one, or auto shields. And auto shields can be really good sometimes. So I think probably don't. Get rid of water shields, even though sometimes it's useless. Sometimes it's really good. Storm is not that great. But we've got a few powers, so it does something. I think we can give it a beam cell. Or we could not spend any gold. Save the rest of my gold. Tempest very good at that kind of fight. Steam Barrier plus Self Repair Recycle plus. Recycle. I mean, we probably would recycle Thunder. And we could recycle all for one. I might try it now. Let's try the cycle now. Run up some more things to the deck that seem to make it good. Pretty spicy. Nine energy tempest. Can't complain about that. Beam cell plus charge battery plus. Charge battery plus is tempting. How much block do we actually have? We've got auto shields, which sometimes doesn't do anything. Reinforced body, two cool headeds, a charge battery, a glacier. A chill, which exhausts. So chill and chill and auto shields don't really count because sometimes this can't be played, sometimes it's exhausts. So actual consistent block cards. We've got reinforced body, two cool headed, charge battery, which is not buffed on glacier. We always keep the energy. 
I really don't hate charge battery. But orbs are better. Orbs are better. I'm gonna skip. Right, which way are we going now? Up the left. Wow, aggregate's actually nuts now. I actually don't want a reinforced body here. I want to save my energy, right? Unless we have like calipers. Don't need to consume me either. Save the energy. Hey, Prof. Like, how was your birthday? It was very good, thank you. Yeah, it was great. Had uh, some friends around. Uh, played some games. Had some drinks. Played some music. It was really nice. Turning the big 35. 55, actually. Imagine how cool it would be if we had, uh, what's it called? Unceasing Top. Unceasing Top would be pretty nuts in this deck as well. Where whenever we're out of cards, we draw a card. Right, I think we do want to do Elites. So here we go. Amplify, defrag, and electro. Seven times three again. Consume isn't doing a whole lot for us here. I'll use the fission just to proc the frost orb, and now we can consume. Seven energy makes it a pretty good turn to Tempest. Would it be lethal here? Easily, right? Nice. Ooh, data disc. Storage combo one focus. That's a good one. Hey, Sandra, how are you? What's going on? Recycle removes Amplify after you play Yellow Powers. That is also pretty smart. Chaos plus Consume plus Rebound plus. I don't think we want a second Consume plus. We don't have the orb, orb slots. Like, at the moment, I'm only able to play Consume once. 
Um, I don't think we can take a second one. Chaos is okay, but I don't think we need it. Right, do we want to go to another shop or a campfire? Probably a campfire. We go to an event as well this way. What do we upgrade? I could recall here. There's nothing that's not going to upgrade. I'm going to, uh... Gonna recall. Ooh. Ooh, we got the spicy one. The spicy one. Fire boss back one for a rare relic. Upgrade all cards. You can no longer heal. Most of my deck is upgraded. It's probably a rare relic, yeah. Had a great birthday, thank you, Sins. Thank you, Sins. Cheers. Hope you're doing well. Hope you've got a good weekend as well. Vision. Uh, I think consume is still fine. Big aggregate into a humongous tempest. I feel like normally my defect runs that win have biased cognition. We don't have biased cognition. Oh, it's a big glacier. It's a big glacier. We love to see it. Yeah, we don't have biased cognition in this deck. So this could mean that the run is doomed. Oh! Oh, bag of prep is so good. But we can't take it. Such a shame that that's the relic we have to miss here. Ah, that's brutal, actually. That makes our, our turn one so much more consistent. But, yeah, gonna have to go without it. Try and conserve the energy for a big tempest. Could consume. I don't hate it. Problem with the reinforced body is it does spend all of my energy, which I don't want to do it here. Cycle Amplify now. Tempest. It's 
Still got a lot of damage to go here. Nine times four. This is a bit scary. Cool headed gives me block over multiple turns. This is pretty sketchy, to be honest. Like, if we have a turn where we don't draw much block, we're in trouble. Thankfully, we are drawing quite a lot of block. Damage keeps going up. Interesting that we can recycle Sunder. And then we can all for one the recycle. damage right now. That's damage. Okay, this was actually pretty close, to be fair. War paint. Upon pick up upgrade two random skills. Buffer. Buffer's a good one to upgrade. Think about the bosses here in the in the heart. Like, is, does Buffer really like Buffer is not that great against the heart? It's never really bad though. Amplify with Buffer. That's true. It is a card we actually want to upgrade as well. Like, there's not much in my deck I want to upgrade. Whereas Buffer is something we could spend our upgrade on. So we'll upgrade it. Charge battery plus glacier plus. Can't complain. Right. Do we want to do enemy, enemy, elite, enemy? Or campfire, enemy, event, enemy? We might want to play this a bit safer. If we do the campfire, we can upgrade buffer. Enemies, more chance of capacitor. Yeah, capacitor would be huge, to be fair. Capacitor would be huge. 42 health. We struggled against the head a bit, but we know the next elite is the head. Alright, let's get for it.
Um, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I think we have a capacitor in the last shop at this point. Possibly. Or capacitor right now? No. Overclock plus. Do we want more draw? I mean, the overclock is more interesting because of the recycle, right? The fact we can excite, ex exhaust the burns. But I've already got one overclock. I've already got one overclock. Yeah, the Storm is probably the most useless card in the deck now. Like, even the All for One is having a bit of use. I'm gonna overclock. I'm a little bit worried about having too many burns, but I think because we've got the uh, recycle, it's not as bad. This sucks. No block so far. It really sucks. Power Potion, Streamline, Loop, Heat Sinks. We could consider Loop. Because we don't have many Orb slots, the Orb going off multiple times could compensate for that a little bit. It's another card we want to upgrade though. Now we want to upgrade Buffer. We're getting kind of low, so I'm not sure we're going to be able to upgrade at this camp, to be honest. I think we take loop. Right, got to beat this elite and hope for a really good rally. Hoping for a very, very good rally from this. It's a big block this turn. Aggregate is big. Amplify. Probably overclock first. Amplify, storm and buffer. I don't really like recycling Glacier to be honest. Glacier is a great card. Do any damage now? Thunder. Is actually not what we need. Oh, 
Auto shield's being unplayable a couple of times here. This is a bad turn. Okay, we're down to one orb slot there. Ginger, you can no longer become weakened. Generally considered quite a good relic, but not that good for us here. Recursion plus, Streamline Fusion plus. We still don't really need energy. So I'd probably still skip. Is Recursion that bad? It's not that bad. Recursion isn't that bad. Lemon one just resubscribed for 79 months. Four in a row this morning, downfall this afternoon, easy. Four in a row this morning, downfall this afternoon. Wait, you actually got four in a row this morning, Lemon? Damn. Yo, welcome back to the Jackals. Thank you very much. Yeah, the alerts is the sound on the alert is working for some reason. I saw that. But, um. That's what you're doing? Oh, that's what I'm doing. I see. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I, I do actually want to play downfall. But we got to do the four in a row first. 100%. <laughs> I guess you only have nine minutes. Oh, shit. Okay, let's go. Right. Uh, Skip these. Let's go. Go fast. Shit, quick. A million energy. the energy. Oh. This turn isn't nice. I am starting to get slightly concerned about the burns. Okay, chill. Go down to one orb. <laughs> it's not normally a good idea. Achievement, finish run without orbs. Okay, come on. Capacitor! Reinforced body plus again. I'd probably take a second one. It's just that good. It's annoying because it stops the build-up of energy. But it's just so good. Right. We probably on 34 health, we're probably gonna rest here. We got time here. How do we even beat time here? We could try and set up a humongous tempest.
51 damage. Oh, that's the buff I got, probably. What if we just cycled Sunder? If you recycle one of the reinforced bodies, you get the energy you're currently on. Wait, what? Is that- so wait, hang on a second. If I had recycle and reinforced body in my hand here, I would get to 32 energy? Wait. It doesn't work- does it work like that? That's correct? Wait, really? Holy shit, I did not know that. It does. Wow. Recycle reinforced waiting room? Exactly. Play three cards next turn. Good to doom and skip, though. It means I can only play two cards next turn. We're about to take 34 damage. Take Glacier. Thirty-seven energy. Holy crap. We have to do some serious maths here, I think. When we draw Tempest again. We can't consume again, right? I don't think we can. 37 energy reinforced body. I mean, if we had calipers, we'd probably just do it. If we have calipers, I think we'd just do it. Oh, 
lord. Right, let's think about this. A 39 energy tempest plus. <laughs> That's like, uh... So if we invoke one, it's 16, so like... I mean, yeah. <laughs> That's amazing! <laughs> Get that guy out of here, nice. Alright, don't be the pat. We want the donut and decker. Let's go. Nice. Okay. Now we can play all of our cards. Wait, so if I re should we should, 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 should we test this? I've got to test this at some point, right? I gotta test the recycle reinforced body if that actually works. We take quite a lot of damage here though. For science. I mean I've gotta test it, right? Ugh. I kinda wanna use reinforced body for block booster. Is the way I'm going to win just having a ridiculously big Tempest? Like, is that actually the way I'm going to beat the heart? Maybe it is. Oh, that's a cat. Six, we take six damage? I don't want to take six damage, so... Ah, fuck it. Let's just test it. Oh, God. Wow, it actually works. Damn. Good to Tempest now. Really wanted to play Electro first, though. Imperative. It's not a word I use very often. Imperative that we would draw a block every turn. Okay, fission. Electro helps a lot. Okay, it's looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. I mean, we got Tempest in our deck somewhere. Don't know how much energy that now. Cycle consume. Yo, six six. I mean, I actually don't think we're gonna beat the heart. I don't know. We've done okay. Like we've done okay so far, but I am not feeling confident against the heart at all. And you used it correctly, growing wise in your old age. <laughs> yeah, every birthday I, I teach myself a new word. And uh, add it to my vocabulary. Imperative is going to be used every day now. Runic capacitor would be juicy. 
Right, rest or upgrade. If we were going to upgrade, it would be loop or buffer, which are pretty good upgrades. They're pretty big upgrades. You have a sundial and a recycle and many powers and exhausts. Just saying. <laughs> Loop upgrade is similar to an orb slot? Yeah. But buffer upgrade is big as well. Buffer upgrade is also big. They're both pretty big upgrades. To the point where I think I will go for an upgrade here. And because we've got the Amplify as well, it just makes it that little bit, all of the powers that little bit better. If we can Amplify Loot Plus or Amplify Buffer Plus, it's pretty big. Just got my first ever heart kill. Big props to these streams that helped me teach me the game. Hey, Juicy. Congrats, well played, GG. Which, uh, which character was it? Right, we're going to upgrade, we're going to upgrade Loot. For the consistency through the heart fight. That's amazing that you got that from Jack's advice. <laughs> right, we need a huge shop here. We need a humongous shop. We need some incredible relic. Uh, what would we remove if we removed a car? Let's just think about this beforehand. It probably would still be the storm. But yeah, a remove isn't that important. Like, we don't, we're not desperate for a remove. So, we want to focus on relics here. And maybe adding a really strong card. Okay. Let's go. Huge shot! <laughs> Capacitor. That's big. It's not upgraded. But it's still big. Clockwork souvenir. We don't have... Ooh... We don't have bias cognition. We could do Clockwork Souvenir and Art of War and Capacitor. Can we afford that? 320, 400. We can afford that. Hologram to bring back Amplify. I can't get any potions because I've got Sozu. Doom and Gloom can do with the remove. Mm. I'm thinking double relic capacity here, to be honest. Bottled flame for consistency? Nah, I mean, what would we even bottled flame? There's nothing. Compile driver, maybe. So we definitely go capacitor. Now what? Hologram? Hologram can be good. Hologram can be really good. We can bring back reinforced body. We can bring back amplifier to use with a power. We can bring back card draw. So hologram is interesting here. Let's see, if we go for hologram, could we also go for a remove? Um, hologram recycle. I mean, which is better for us? Art of War or Clockwork Souvenir? How many attacks do we have? We have Doom and Gloom, Ball Lightning, Sunder, Compile driver, another ball lightning. That's like five. We've got like five attacks. Yeah. Maybe Art of War isn't that good. Because most of my lightning orbs are with the ball lightnings. Like, we don't have that much damage. Our damage comes through the odd bits of lightning with the fact we've got a bit of focus. You exhaust under anyway.
I'm not sure which is better. Like, none of these relics are, like, insane for us right now, to be honest. Like, none of them are insane. But they're both, they're both okay. They're both okay. <laughs> Good Instinct Plus. Remove Sunder. Yeah, we could buy one of these and remove a card. Yeah, that's true. Art of War, remove Sunder. Oh, this is such a big decision, man. This is such a big decision. Uh... Like, the thing is, the hologram does make us more consistent against the heart. Like, that is genuinely a thing. Especially with lots of energy, which we have. Like, the more energy we have, the better hologram becomes. But because we've got lots of energy, I do kind of like the hologram. I could remove a card instead of going with the relics. I gotta make a decision here. I gotta make a decision. I'm gonna go hologram. I'm just here. Is good instincts plus a good add? Nine block zero energy. Plus. Game block equals the number of cards in your discard pile plus three. So if we played lock, our deck is pretty big. If our discard pile's big, that could be a lot of block. So that could be a lot of block. Let's try it. Cold snap. Here we go! Here goes nothing! Uh. Right then. Full headed. Full headed. Aggregate. That's a lot of energy. Right. All for one does nothing. E frag. This is bad. This is very bad. Fuck, we've lost all of our health. All our health's gone. Damn. I love how Jack is still surprised every time when he's t turned to an act for elites are so bad. I mean, if we just, you know, drawn some card draw or block would be okay, but...
Like, why couldn't we have just had this last time? Tempest here. We could buff a Tempest. Probably better. Kunai. Every time you make three attacks in a turn, gain one dexterity. Mm. Barrage, self repair plus leap plus. Right. Seizing, seeing as we're on 25 health, do we need to take leap plus? The glaciers are still better. Wow, doing the heart with 25 health is so bad. It's either leap plus or skip. Right, this is going to be hard. Oh, God! Not sure if we can do this. Not sure if this deck can do this. So we want to set up the frost. We're dead. We're just dead. No. Oh, that sucks. I just drew terribly. We drew terribly on this the spear fight and this fight. So brutal, man. So brutal. Oh, man. The deck felt good, but... If you get unlucky draws in those last two fights, there's nothing you can do about it. You just die. Seeing the bag of prep in the chest with the key, that was the end right there. I mean, yeah, we could have not taken the key before, right? Which had, was the more bank or whatever. Like, I took more bank. I could have skipped that, and then we would have ended up getting back a prep. So maybe that was actually the play. Obviously, you can't know you're going to get back a prep in that. It's pretty brutal, but yeah. 